everyone, it's me, Nat, and I'm here to tell you why I love Pyro. <laughs> also, you'll see me attempting to play TF2 in the background using my art tablet instead of a mouse, so just a warning, I have probably the worst TF2 gameplay known to man. My character was constantly spinning, so just warning. I also find irony in the fact that this whole video is about Pyro, but the gameplay is me of playing NG. <laughs> but disclaimer, this is a very opinionated video, and you don't have to agree with my glorification of the almighty mercenary Pyro. But not only do I love to play Pyro, but I love Pyro's character. They're funny, cute one of the more interesting characters of Team Fortress. A lot of people say nothing is known about Pyro, but I disagree. They have a very distinct personality, and as much as they can be interpreted as evil, I think of them as more as very innocent, pure, and naive to the bad things they have been doing. The way I interpret their personality is that they are silly, childish, and a sweet person if you get to know them even though they are a stereotype of people with schizophrenia as seen in the Meet the Pyro video. But other than those things that I've mentioned, they also seem quite fickle as seen in the showdown. Another thing that I love is the way the other characters in Team Fortress interact with Pyro. I loved seeing Scout, Pyro, and Soldier interact in the comic, and I honestly want to see more of it. And Pyro and Engie's relationship is absolutely adorable, and just makes sense for the comic and game. In the game, there's this thing called Pyros, and for those of you who don't know what that is, I'll tell you. A Pyro is when a Pyro sticks around an engineer and protects their building, the engineer, and spy checks often to make sure everything is safe and sound for the engineer. Playing the game, having Pyro and NG be good friends just makes sense. And in the TF2 mini comic, True Meaning, NG is seen reading Pyro Christmas stories, and so they probably live together, which makes sense with how complimentary they are to each other in the game. Speaking of the game, playing Pyro is an amazing feeling. They're fun to play, easy to control, and they have the best cosmetics so you can look hella cute while you're roasting the other team. It's a lot more helpful to the team, and I've made many friends with engineers over Team Fortress. Pyro, overall, is one of my favorite characters to draw as well. I think their design is adorable, and it's really fun for me to draw. It, I have, I have, I have drawings upon drawings of Pyro in my computer, and I just love their character. Pyro is just one of my favorite characters of all time, and they're the reason I started playing Team Fortress. So, that's all on why I love Pyro. If you happen to get this far, tell me down below on what you disagree or agree with. Hopefully I'll see you next time. Peace out, Pyros. While they are a stereotype of schizophrenia, as seen in the the pyro video, other they're the 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 frick. The way I interpret their personality is that they are silly, childish, and a sweet person if you get to know them. While being a stereotype, I just love to play as pyro, and having pyro and energy. I love to play as Pyro. As I mentioned before, before, I prefer to be a Pyro when I play Pyro.